Some of the worst wait lists in the state have prevented Eau Claire parents from using a children's support program. However, the Eau Claire County Board will be voting tomorrow on a resolution that could change that. News 18's Elliot Adams reports. The Children's Long-Term Support Program is a state and federally funded program that uses Medicaid waivers to help children with disabilities. The program provides support and adaptive resources for families. In Eau Claire County, this service is unavailable for many. Officials say the average wait time for eligible families is 305 days, a number that is out of compliance with the State Department of Human Services expected wait time of 90 days. For a good year and a half, it was just silence. No letters, no nothing. Um, and it just, it made me feel like we weren't cared about. Savannah Bertrand says she waited over 700 days for her son to get off the wait list. And in that time, her husband had to quit his job to care for their children. The Eau Claire County Department of Human Services proposed solution is the creation of 10 new caseworker positions along with supervisor and resource specialist roles. Uh, doing the math when you take 10 workers who carry caseloads with an average estimate of about 30 to 33 cases, that adds up to the number of kids on the wait list. Eau Claire currently has over 200 eligible children awaiting services. If passed, the positions will not cost the county any money and will instead be funded by the state. The resolution means a lot to Bertrand because if passed, other parents won't have an experience like hers. I will probably cry um, in a good way, in a good way. Um, but I, I will feel kind of proud to live in Eau Claire again. The county board will vote August 15th on the resolution. For News 18, I'm Elliot Adams. All right, thanks, Elliot. Now, if that resolution is passed, five temporary caseworkers will be offered full-time positions, while the hiring process for the seven other positions can begin immediately.